Hello, welcome back. Last time, somehow I only did half a flag, and it was a time. Uh, hopefully things will go a little better this time. I still don't know, I did realize one little bit of jank that I was the one who brought. I, this will not let me look backward, I'm sure. Uh, but after that first jump where there was a crystal, I realized what I could almost certainly do instead of, like, kissing the electricity the way I did and dashing right, is I could have dashed left and then did a reverse super. And even if I wasn't, like, doing a proper reverse super with enough distance to get my dash back, the crystal would have done it for me. So that was a way that I could have maybe made that slightly easier on myself. Anyway, so you do this once, then it's set up for a wave dash? And then that comes up. Okay, I didn't even know that was there. I, I guess I can see it now. If I had known where to look, I could have seen it then. Okay, so, uh, uh, uh. All right, you know what? Would it be easier to just, what? No, that would propel me upwards and I'm gonna have to do this and get on there. You still want to go up somewhere somehow, apparently? Do you want this? No. Then up right, okay. All right, so just figure out what's happening. Not that, maybe a reverse wave dash could do something good there? Well, that reverse didn't reverse. Am I just unable to pull off? Well, no, the, the reason is because it's moving, so I'm not actually hitting the ground there. Okay. All right, let's look. Well, I guess I can't. Right, I can see just in the very extreme upper left corner about half of what's going on there. Uh, <laughs> free look binoculars would be nice there. Yeah, but like this tells me nothing. Uh, right, there's a big gap to cross somewhere and that's the end of the room. Okay. All right. Okay, if you say so, Madeline. I was telling you to dash down, but you dashed left instead. I mean, I, I guess I just didn't hold the thing for long enough. Um, this could be a problem. Oh, I get what I'm supposed to do. I think. Yeah, that's probably it. Okay. Gotta aim for something that doesn't exist yet. Oh, and you want me to... You want me to do an air super on something that I can't see. Are you serious? That is so rude. However, since it's moving upward, I guess it's actually a very forgiving hitbox. Still rude, less rude than I thought. Still rude. I don't appreciate. That goes that way, so you want to reverse wave on that, I think. Uh, no, you probably want to reverse air super. Because of course you always want that. Does anybody like those? Is this just a me thing? Like, is it my individual handicap where I have a tr uh, problem with that? Okay, so that thing's gonna what? I have a big horizontal gap to cross, so somehow I need some rightward motion from somebody somewhere. I understand how to get... Uh, how to get... Uh, I don't understand anything. It's gonna go up right, which is a weird direction. Then I'm here, then it's gonna go back down. That thing goes there. What, where am I going? What am I doing? Like, binoculars tell me, well, they can sort of tell me about this if I did some dashes and then re-looked in them, but that's very inconvenient. Do you want me to wave dash? I'll try that. The angle wasn't right for it. Uh, do you want me to air super? You probably do. That's This is the air super thing. But I'm hitting some spikes. I guess those spikes on the way up. Alright, let's try stalling instead. Just like dash in a way that lands there. So I can just, just kind of... Hmm. Easier said than done. I guess do it way earlier. What if I just... Forget about reverse supers and just do something simpler. I imagine that won't ultimately work. Yeah, I'm not in where I need to be. <sighs> okay. 
So now that I'm here... I see it. That's the right word motion that I need, and you're all gonna go into spikes and just be away from me, right? Zoom. Yeah, so you go back to your home. Okay, so I can do this as many times as I want, it looks like. They're in a stable cycle. Okay, so somehow you want me to... Yeah, thanks, Binoculars. This is such a helpful angle. <laughs> like, really. Uh... So I do need to land that super or wave dash. Except the problem is the spikes are there. Maybe I don't? What if I don't? Maybe if I'm going down, I'll be immune to those spikes. Like, I can get the wave dash angle. Like, I had the... I had it right there, I just didn't, like, cash it in. Uh... Yeah, see, no, I need to already be in the air over there. That thing needs to collide with me and move me to the right. So I understand my goal, at least in this part of the... thing. This seems a lot more manageable than first half of the room. Still some weird momentum things going on. I don't always understand why I go where I go. Like, why didn't I go upward there? I must have jumped from just the wrong place somehow, but what wrong place how? Okay, so that was what I wanted. I just needed to press the jump button at a different time. Wah! All right, after that... I'm on this thing, and I probably just do, like, a... I don't know, what, a hyper bunny hop or something? And hope it goes fast and I get there? Something like that. I'll try it. Hmm. Okay, up right might... Uh, I probably do want, like, a proper wall bounce, so I just need to be higher. Whoa, don't do that. Wait. Alright. This is doable. Eventually. Then the color will be back, and that'll be nice. Okay, no, I need to... I need to... Mm, I need to be higher, that's the thing. So don't worry about your horizontal position. Worry vertical only. Yep, dang it. And there I got the bad jump. I think... Okay, theory. What is happening is I'm jumping too late and the coyote time doesn't carry the momentum of the block. Again, I'm worrying horizontal instead of vertical. No, I think what it is is I need to... No. No, no, no. I don't think an air super is appropriate there. I think it needs to be a wave dash. Right? Or doesn't that give me enough height? I don't know. Let's try it a few more times. Yeah, so coyote time jump probably just doesn't come with the block momentum or something. That's my guess. There we go. Okay. So being here, you're gonna go right. Let's just try an extended hyper and see how that does. Yeah, that was totally enough. I just needed to input my dash earlier. I didn't know the bottom of the screen was so close to me. And the color comes back as I'm in flight. Okay. Had no way to know at the time, but I... Uh, no, I should not have done this after what happened last time. No, no. This is... What's happening here is correct. Okay, so... Uh, uh, hmm, didn't quite make it. I'll try a bunny hop, I guess. Since I can do that pretty consistently now. Uh, I didn't do it right. I don't think that's... Is that the way to go? I'll try it. Or is it supposed to be a super? Let's try that, actually, since that seems to be mostly what this is about. Alright, so just plain old super. No, that didn't work at all. Okay. I My timing might have been the problem there. I'm not sure if the, the choice of move was the problem. Anyway, extended uh, hyper seems to get me, like, basically as far as I need to get, and I think if I'm just, like, a little better about the, the end of this, I can do it. Like, if I grab on there, I can totally make it. Okay, well that's fun now that I know what's happening. Alright, I'm gonna be a little farther over. Uh, got a dash later. Alright. This might not be, like, what I'm officially supposed to do. However, it's what I'm doing. Because I've seen that it can work. Alright, so if I'm way over here... 
There we go. There we go. All right. Good enough for me. Wah! <laughs> All right. This is fine. Flag 4. This is, um, Wormfish is the name of the music track, but that's not the name of the place. The Lab was the name of the place. Yeah, Wormfish. That was the name of that song, for whatever reason. <laughs> Okay, right, and this is the absolutely unparsable one, so I just have to try it, see where the portals take me, and which directions, just like, build up a script of directions that I'm going. You are mover and with spikes, and that takes me th Okay, right, so these work like... That felt right. Then what? So I'm doing a buffered wave dash there. That goes up your... Oh, right, there's space distortion going on. That's why that, that floor is not level. <laughs> I forgot these things just stood up the space around them. It's a subtle enough effect that I don't notice it until I start, like, really looking at the pixels. Okay, so touch switch. That was not the only one. There's another... Where do I think I'm going? What's with the mover? I guess I'm getting things out of its way and it's gonna help me later? It goes all the way to there and I need to like... wall cling on it. There's a door to open. There's the button for the door, okay. Touch switches for this block. Where do I go from here though? Probably back in that Portal, I would guess? So I'm gonna guess you want to reverse wave dash on this. Then I'll be up there going... Would right kill me? It looks like it to me. Ah, uh, but the traffic light will be there, so no it wouldn't. So do a buffered wave dash once again. Second wave dash on here. Down left into there. Then I'll be portaled to this, I assume? There's another door. Okay, right, so... Up, dash up, spring, hit switch, go back into portal. I don't know what the portal state will be, but maybe I'll end up there. Down right, dash right, get crystal. Here's a weird little alcove I can just kind of hang out for a moment or something? What's this about? Oh, I'm supposed to go... There's a bunch more stuff happening. Right, okay, multiple door buttons. Then something going on here. Okay, that's just the end of the level. Okay, uh, if you say so. Oops. Alright, so those need to be out of the way for the thing. So, okay, reverse didn't reverse. I... doesn't that portal go away? No, it comes back. Alright, so watch out for that. Do you really want it? <sighs> the gross thing. No, 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 I just gotta dash differently. Or, uh... uh hmm. I need to go fast here. See... Uh, in theory, I could maybe activate that without... the spike, spiky top of it. But... In practice, I don't think that's gonna happen. Because, <laughs> like, there's just enough space in there to... Yeah, okay, see. Theoretically, it's possible. Theoretically, it's possible. I proved the theory, that's enough for me. Maybe a left dash there would get me there? It just doesn't look like I have the height. But an up left also would be the wrong angle. No, that was... Okay, maybe an up left would get me there. There's... there's the traffic light creates a ceiling. Okay, I'm there now. Oops, nope, gotta start the thing moving. Probably. I assume I have to. It's here. It's here for a reason. If I don't do it, then I'll never do it. Why did I get worse at reverse wave dashing? Well, because I didn't do it for a while, probably. Um, yeah, you want another wave dash there. Got it. Mm hmm. Learning the script. Alright, I'm here and I'm going up, I think. Whoops, I had to hit the switch on the way. Okay, got it. Whoop, nope, wrong way. 
Yeah, I just got worse at reverse wave dashing. I just, I lost the timing. And I didn't know which direction I was going there. That's fine. Okay, that was mostly right, but a part of it wasn't. <clears throat> the timing of this is weird. That's fine. Okay, now what? I guess get in that portal and then what do you imagine? So this will be closed. I think I just gotta catch up with the uh, the mover so I can jump off, get that wall bounce, spring bounce dash up, spring bounce dash up, hit that, hit the other thing, portal to... Like, when do I interact with this part of the level? Does like a portal move in there or something? Maybe this one stays and that door opens. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay, got it. So once I'm at that point, just get into that portal quick. Fast bubble out of it, grab the thing, and... Yeah, okay, so that's just gonna depend on the timing of, like, when everything else happens. Just hope that sort of lines up good. Oops. Alright, I can do that. Uh, I should go down right, and I should be fast bubbling more, I guess? Since I am in a race, but I don't want to. <laughs> Whenever I fast fall or fast bubble, except in places where it's clearly, like, the answer, I always regret it, so I, I like to avoid doing it when it's not, like, absolutely strictly required, because see, like, that wasn't the... Right, okay, so I have to... Once I'm at the springboards... I do have to dash up after that springboard. Like, this is a lot of inputs, quickly. After the second springboard and I dash up, hopefully I'll be in that pink crystal. I do one up to hit that switch, an up right to hit the other switch. Theoretically, I could get on top of that switch and put my feet down if I mess up the earlier part of it. Okay, well, if I don't get enough dash to actually collide with it... I don't want to hit the portal, though. Anyway, yeah, I assume I'll go back to that portal where I'll go up... Dash up, get that dash up, do a wave dash there. Then probably, uh... Upright to recover, because that's too far to cover with one wave dash. Then an extended hyper on that, since it's... No, a super on that. Okay, so land, then super. Do a wall bounce that doesn't hit that surface, so don't do an outward boost on the wall bounce, just upwards. And then just kind of ride it, it'll take me straight into the portal where I go down and I'm done. Okay. I can say the words. I can do the actions too. This might not happen first try. Or will it? Almost. A lot of that did. Most of that was right. I just was a little too far left to uh, hit the thing. And that's easily fixed. Whoa, okay, I made it. Uh, didn't do the wall bounce good there. Yeah, so lining myself up for that wall bounce is one part of this. It's definitely not free for me. One of the weak points in my skill set. That's okay, I acknowledge it. I can't really compensate for it, but... Yeah, this tells me where I'm gonna have trouble. That's supposed to be a downright. Like, it, it can be done as a right, but it's better as a downright. Whoops, that's supposed to be a downright. It can't be done as a right. Oi! Ah, yeah, this is a lot of inputs at once. Ah. My thumb is working hard. Oh, yeah. Well, gotta do a different thing. Okay, good. No, but I forgot which direction I was going there. Okay. It's a lot. This is a lot. But it's fun. I like it. This room's good. 
Oh, yeah. Oops. Yeah, I, I, I can do that to the right. It's acceptable. And apparently that's what my instincts say to do, so let's just hone in on that version, I guess. Since there'll be less resistance to it. Sure, that's fine. Okay, up. Okay, perfect. Uh, I needed to go down. Just hold down once you're on the traffic light. Just hold down, make no other inputs. Ooh, almost didn't make that, but I did. Whoa! I forgot where I was going. Alright, two springboards, not just one. Whoa! Confusing myself, that's my fault. Whoop! Okay, no, I get... The timing of that, not obvious to me. Just like, interrupting springboard motion is another slight weak point of mine. I'm just judging, like, springboard motion in general. I don't know why it's so hard for me, it's just something I am never quite able to internalize for whatever reason. Hua, hua, hold down. There we go, I did it. Alright, that was great. Did I dare try three? I might. What is it, superstructure? I think so. What was the superstructure mechanic? Yeah, that's a battery or something. I pick it up and it starts running out and I have to put it in that blinking thing sort of a little bit left of it. There's another one. That blinking thing in the upper right. That thing I bought from the front and it goes down, I think? Then last thing in the thing. What's foreground and what's background here? I think all of those girders there are... Yeah, those are all background. I can see the foreground one with a slippery surface and the spikes on it right in the middle. But the rest of that's background. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure what's up with all the mid-air traversal I'm going to have to do here. How's that going to work out? Uh, so there's a block on a track there. That I can do this to. Then I could get a boost off of it and it'll go somewhere. Let's just sort of see what, what happens. What? Oh, okay, that's plausible. So I was holding climb that whole time and just sort of naturally... That landed in my hands. I think that's what I want. I go down to that springboard. I need to do a, uh, like, a, a drop climb sort of thing. So elevate the battery up there, throw it, get on the springboard again, then... Uh, I'm not sure what happens after that. Maybe I spring all the way to that wall, climb to that wall, get the pink crystal, go up upright, and then... Ah, that um, moving block will be in that spot, so I think I'm actually wall bouncing on it. Okay, let's worry about the rest after I've figured out that first part, because that was already a lot. Yeah, that's already a lot. How do you want me to... How do you want me to? Like, what do you want me to do with this thing? Oh, I'm supposed to jump on the wall on the way down. Okay, like this. There we go, that makes it easy. Oops, I... Right, I can throw against the wall and that gives me more, uh, more height than drop re-grabbing. Okay. So, like, uh... Kinda like that, only not garbage. There we go, that was much less garbage. Okay. You're gonna have to be a lot less garbage than that, though. There's still plenty of garbage in there. Okay, so, left, right, left. Or, no, there's no last left. The last is just... okay. Uh, like this, um, well, I wasted my thing, but that's okay, because I can do this still. See? Okay, so I gotta be a little higher for that. I can climb on that surface. Don't have to be midair for that part. Whoops, okay. 
And I have an extra dash of leeway there in case I need it. I should just, just freely use. Okay, well, that was enough that time. I could also maybe climb on the wall that I, uh, where I, like, the battery socket is. Let's just not need to. Oops, I, okay, that's fine. I did this again, but it's, it's totally okay. Eh, it could have been. Alright, so I do want that dash for, um, for getting to the pink crystal. Because, like, then I don't have to do the uh, neutral jump jank. I, why do I keep doing that? I don't know, I panic? Uh, what am I doing? No, no, I can't climb on that surface. The, the angle doesn't quite allow it, so I do need to do the, uh... Line up the wall bounce from uh, what I was doing there. Okay, that's almost... Oops. What? This room seems like it won't ultimately be a problem. I threw from too high. I have no particular worries here. Yeah, I threw from too high. Okay, so if you're too high, just wait a moment. I can detect that and correct for it. I waited a moment. Okay. Uh, oh, I don't get there, so I should just, like, actually just, like, dash up right away. I don't need to climb on those walls, like, at all, probably. Just go here and, uh, see. Now I'm in the bad spot. So from right here, I probably want to dash up and do, like, a late... Yeah, Like that, basically? Except, again, not garbage. Right, and I haven't routed out the this part of this room. So once I'm there, I'm picking that up, and it's unclear what's happening. Because, like, that's... That's not... Hang on, there's supposed to be another block there. Oh, there's a block right there I did not see. That icy surface is something I have to bop on my way. Okay, that was invisible to me. Alright, so I bop that thing. And... Not sure exactly how that interacts with everything, but it's... It kind of follows me around, and that's my solution to... Not having a floor in places. Okay. I wonder how many more of those I'm not seeing yet. I guess I'll learn when I have an impossibility and have to go spot one. So I do this. Yeah, and that just lines me up for the wall bounce perfectly. Okay, everything makes more sense in that area now. Yep. Yeah. Uh -huh. Bop. Do that. Do, uh... Sort of. Right, the pad on that thing is so that I can wave dash on it or something? Oh jeez, you want what? Do you want me to throw that box, wave dash on the thing, pick up, drop the box, and elevate right then and there? Is that really the suggestion? The way I'm picturing it, that's gonna be hard. Maybe I'm picturing it wrong, maybe I'm not understanding the action that I do. Okay, fortunately I know how to get there now. Alright, well I can just sit here with this box. I don't think that's the thing I want to do though. I think I'm supposed to have thrown it already. However, I can do that. That's doable. I think. I didn't prove it, but I think it is. As in, like, pick it up again after that. What if I did... Mm, maybe pick up, then drop, then do the dash. That might actually work better. Ah, not so sure. Do I have the height for that? Mm. Also, that thing's track continues. I'm like, I'm supposed to do something with it. Like, that keeps on going down after that little metal rope there goes, goes downward. And like, it rejoins... Yeah, that's it there. Rejoining here. Where do I gotta bop it? Left side? How would I do that? Left side is boppable, right side is boppable. Neither of those sides are accessible in that spot, though. Maybe they are barely, but not really. So I just gotta hope it, like, bops itself at some point or something? 
But how am I managing this box? I think I want to throw as soon as I pick it up, then do a wave dash and catch it? Like, that's looked more workable than landing with it in my hands. It's not easy, but it looked possible. Yeah, okay. Throw a little later, right around the time I pick up the crystal, I think. Fortunately, this part of the room is basically solved, I say, not having solved it at all, but uh, check it out, I'm here. Then what? Do I have to bop the corner of that thing to get it to go? Because, like, that corner was mostly electricity infested. There was a clean spot on it that I maybe could hit with that dash, because, like, if I don't do that, then what am I even doing? Oh, there's another bop there. Okay, so there's the other one I didn't spot. Just above and to the right of the door. No, oh, I did spot it earlier. I just forgot about it. Uh, so, alright, so theoretically... I've done the thing with the box. I've thrown it and I still have two dashes. I fall down, I dash right, I dash upright. I've bopped that. Hopefully that gets me enough to get to that crystal. Wait, okay, I was misreading. No, I wasn't. No, 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 that rope continues. To just right at that crystal. No, no, that thing needs to be there. So I do need to bop the friend who's right below me here. Or like, are these two linked or something? Or does putting that... No, that just opens the door. Do I need to bop it? I don't know, let's not worry about it and get to that point and just see if something magical happens. I don't know. This is still a mechanic I feel like I don't fully understand. Or rather, I've only worked with it a few times, so there may be nuances I don't know. So I, I just don't know what's what the bounds of possibility with that thing are. Uh, I guess I was holding down when I dropped that, so it didn't throw. There, I waited. Uh, whoa, that was too high. Alright, that can happen. Uh, where am I? I am... No, oh, I have to bop. Not up, up right. Uh, 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 oh, I'm, I'm still just doing that too high. Okay, so don't go so high. Just, just go a little lower. This room's cool. I'm liking what's happening here. I'm just bad at that part. Like that's... Uh, it feels like I don't quite have the coordination for that. It's just too many things moving at once. It's like me and something else. Two things. That's way too many. Well, and then if you count the floor, it might even be three things. That's basically infinity things. Uh, yeah, okay, so I throw... I'm, I'm just, like, not figuring out the throw timing here. I don't... I haven't given myself a reference point for it. I once said I wanted to do it at the crystal. Let's try that again. That's a good reference point, okay. Uh, magic happened. That thing came. Alright, it's here. I didn't get the crystal, so I'm dead. But here's the situation. So ignore it on the way down. Veer left a little bit for the crystal if you need to. Dash into the springboard if you need to. I can't reach it now. Spring will take me within wall bounce range. Then I want to bounce, grab... I think elevate, then throw? Because... No, I won't have a dash there. So I'm going to have to be in a trajectory where I can just throw right away? Where's the destination? It's just up there. Yeah, okay. And climb on the wall if you need to. Okay. Well, I think that's the whole room. Right at the crystal. Uh, that was a little earlier than the crystal, and it was too early. Right at the crystal. Okay, that was a little earlier than the crystal, it was almost too early. 
Then I, I need some height there, but that's okay. I can just try a few times and I'll have the right height in one of those attempts. At the crystal. Okay. Got the height. Oh, the spring got me on the way down! How rude! That's pretty funny, though. Okay, too high again. Whoops, I did it wrong, because I forget what to do sometimes. There's a whole big barrel of oil there. I think it's gigantic, it's like several times the size of me. Madeline is tiny, though. She's not that tiny. Ah, I dropped. Can't be any down input there, whoops. Yep. Uh, yes, except I wasn't ready for it. Um, that wall bounce trajectory, that looks tight. I think I wasn't positioned well for it, like, even if I had fixed the immediate problem. I think I had a secondary problem there. Uh, whoops. here. Ah, uh, okay, no, it's- oh, right, it's the, the old problem of I can't tell where ice walls are. I always think they're farther out than they are. Right, okay. So, air extremely left. It's just like four pixels, but those four pixels might as well be a mile. Sure, those are comparable units. Why not? Okay, I missed, because I threw a little bit too early. Or other reasons. Okay. I gotta just, like, wait in the air a little bit. Like, if your body is in line with the block you're bouncing off of, don't dash. Wait until it's below. There, below. Yeah, below works better. I, I, I was holding down. I felt myself do it. I'm preparing for the wave dash, but I, I can't prepare until the throw has gone off. Okay, throw went off. Did it. Great. Uh, I forgot to press the climb button, but other than that, okay, I can tell I'm heading into Starlight Station after this. That's gonna be next time. Alright, one last try here. Yeah, why do I say words like that? That's just asking for trouble. It's not, really. It doesn't make a difference to the outcome. But it's usually not gonna line up with the outcome. Yep. Yeah. Uh, okay, I remembered to press it just barely in time, and I'm here! Alright, cool. So, let's flee this flag. There we go, flag two. Alright, so just two more sections left. Either one could be a major thing, so I'm not pushing my luck. But next time, hopefully finishing this heart side, as long as nothing goes terribly wrong. What's left? So I know... What didn't I play? I don't think I have the... entire lobby memorized well enough to identify what flag one's gonna be just off the top of my head. So I'll just have fun being surprised next time. I'll see you then.